The Department of Petroleum Resources has launched its newly established downstream remote monitoring system for regulation and accreditation of petroleum products depots, retail outlets, and the entire downstream in the oil and gas industry. The system will help uh, track movement of products from depots to retail outlets. Beria Mohammed reports. Over the years, the issue of herding and diversion of petroleum products by marketers has posed a challenge since they were not regulated and checked by the DPR. But with the new initiative in place, the activities of marketers will now be monitored. The Department of Petroleum Resources wants that the system will also strengthen its resolve not to compromise safety standards and the quality of petroleum sold to members of the public. The initiative is expected to guard against the crude oil theft, which remains a huge challenge in the sector. Commitment. Some retail outlet owners want government and consumers to understand that the Nigerian economy needs to grow with creativity. Hence, there is need for the petroleum products to be available, useful and reachable to all Nigerians. The Nigerian oil and gas industry is witnessing a digital transformation in line with Mr. President's mandate for transparency, accountability, and domestic energy security. And this is, in, is also in line with the ministerial key priority areas, which include product sufficiency and availability. We will only plead that both the government, um, all the associations, also the, uh, the consumers should be able to understand that Nigeria must be floating, Nigeria must grow, and the economy must grow. So we must find a way to be able to accommodate and become creative in order to make sure that petroleum product, which runs the economy, is available and it is useful and rich by every Nigerian. What we are pushing is price freedom. Nigerians need to have freedom of price different alternative of choice of uh, energy that will ensure our mobility. So what? We have to be factual about the prices. We are selling the raw material, so when we are buying the finished product, we should know that the cost of raw material affects the cost of finished product. The oil and gas sector has encouraged all Nigerians to comply with this initiative in order to make the system work. Mari Mohamed, TVC News, Abuja.